Uzgorod beckons once again. Let's go ahead and uh, fight against that rebellion. Gonna be a raid though, so no defense. Going in and destroying some stuff is going to be the name of the game. Let's see. Level 70 raid. Can we go for max salvage shares? Yes, we can. 48 salvage shares. Okay. No more points available though. But um, this will allow us to get a, a big boy mech, potentially. Heavy weather warning is in effect, Commander. Your visibility and sensor readings will be compromised out there. That's okay. As long as we have the Atlas, we can play this. I wonder if we could get our hands on a good laser boat. That should also be nice for the AI. So if we get like a... What would that be? Maybe a stalker? Or like the annihilated laser boat? That could be nice. If there is a mech you see in a mission that you want to salvage, should you absolutely shred it? If you have low salvage points, you might consider shredding it or at least destroying the arms and one torso or so. Of course, the more damage you put into that mech, the higher difficulty is going to be to actually kill it, right? To uh, cockpit kill it. Okay. Go to the top right base first, then go down to the next wall, and then go to the big one in the center or the left. Uh, we got a little bit of a dust storm here. Hope you guys brought dust particle filters. Let's go after the Phoenix Hawk. I can't target that. Okay, guys, you can't target it. Whatever. I can target it. That's for one B. Um. So, who goes around buildings? I don't. Ah, TTB sneak attack. The TTB sneak attack. A special move of running through a building to attack the enemy from the side. It was glorious. What's that? What? 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 Excuse you? Are you, in Are you insane, dude? Hey, stack polling. Press F to pay respects. Alright, let's go kill that building. It's also a VTOL up there. Isn't that a popular dating method on Grinder? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. Hello, Secret Victor. Boom! <laughs> AC20 to the cockpit. I hope we have enough salvage chests to get this thing, but uh, I couldn't resist, mate. Holy shit, what is that? Not the victor. Not the victor. Okay. Fall back a little bit. Guys, murder the Urbi, please. Urbi is annoying. He's gonna punch out here. Can you please lose your arm? So that's annoying. There we go. Alright, Victor. Let's do this. Don't jump around, dude. It's not cool. That's the cockpit. Can't see him. Stop exploding, dude. Dude! Stop cooking! I can't see his cockpit! <laughs> It was exploding and cooking so much I couldn't see it. There's a Phoenix up behind us. Alright guys, follow me. Too much smoke. Visibility zero. Whoa. Oh shit, he's dropping right on top of us! Why are they shooting the dropship? By the way. 
It makes no sense that they're shooting a dropship. This doesn't take any damage. Like, it makes no sense. Holding at your waypoint. Got one. Let's see if location. we get the other one as well. If I could see it. Got it. All right, now we go after the quick draw. Uh, dude, where are you going? Ex explain to me what you're doing up there. We'll go back for a little bit. Now we engage. All hail and all friendly fire mod. All hail the no friendly fire mod. <laughs> oh man. Come on guys, destroy the derish. Dropships have destroyed the guns on them. Oh, they really do? Cool, didn't know that. Thanks for letting me know. Mm, that was not a bad hit. Where are you going, dude? Stay here with me. Everything will be fine. Bye bye. Uh oh, he's exploding. Stop exploding, you coward! That was an advertisement for Kalayama Weapon Industries, who's making the Auto Cannon 20 that we're rocking. Sir, sir, excuse me, sir, could you stop dying? Yes. That's a question I keep asking myself. Oh, look at that snipe! AC 20! Out of max range, snipe on a turret. Aha! Mwah. Mech porn at its finest. I'm I'm going critical! It's a mushroom cloud here. Oh god. Oh Jaja. No. Oh, oh, oh. no! Yep. In before we get blocked by Twitch and YouTube. Ang angry angry mech porn not allowed, but hot tub streams. Hot tub streams. That's that's the thing. Uh, ouch! Fucking J Edgar. Partisan. Nice. Target SMs are really nice to clean up tanks with. The uh, firing rate is just really good. We're still a thousand meters out. I'm gonna send my. I'm gonna send the, the cavalry in. Moving to grid. Because I take a lot of damage so far. Bonilla is also not looking too hot. Let's see. Leg damage, that's fine. That guy is still fine. That guy is also still mostly fine. We took some damage, but we're still looking good. Put an Atlas in the hot tub. Says Gleblock. Gleblock. <laughs> Atlas hot tub stream. It's gonna be a oil hot tub though. You don't want that atlas to rust. I turned my atlas into a whole tub, hot tub of molten armor and my armor muscles the other day. Yep, we did that. Oh, well, this that's not helping. Not recommended to use night vision here. <laughs> oh, turret. Leave me alone. Eliminated. Mm, I think we're gonna approach from the south side here. I wonder what the extraction point's gonna be, but it's probably gonna be like somewhere to our east. If I had to guess. If I had to guess, I would guess east! Hello! Oh! Uh oh, he's stack polling. Why do they always have to run into your mechs and then stack pull? It's kind of like suicide fighters, suicide bombers. Run into your mechs, shoot like crazy, and then when they're, when they're right in between them, they just go boom. Told ya, we have to go to the right again. 
though. I was right. Let's to go to the east. Faro! Drink on my beer, you mighty and enjoy. Okay. Faro beer. That must be some old age stuff. What's going on with these traffic lights? They're just going bonkers. Oh, a turret. A boom. The shell just went straight through the turret and destroyed it. Haha. <laughs> That's cool. What can tanks do against the hum uh, against the battle mech? Not much. At least in this game. I mean, if you if you gave me the choice of a battle mech or a group of four level two A6 battle mechs, not a battle mechs, battle tanks, MBTs, I'm guaranteeing that the MBTs win. Because that mech is gonna get destroyed at the range of like two or three kilometers, never even seeing the tank. Two of demolishers. Ah, demolishers suck. I mean, AC20. You've got a, you've got a, a tank that has an effective range of 300 meters. A tank with an effective range of 300 meters. You could literally piss that distance. <laughs> Let's not overthink it. It's big stoppy robots. Don't overthink it. Concept of long range battle like a suspect is best. Yep. All right, mission done. Let us see what we get for it. Let's see if we get like one of those victors. We should get one of them. Hope I'm hoping that we get two. Because if we get two, I might be able to show you the difference between the salvage points. 1.4 million civils. I will just get the one. So this was the one that I just cockpit killed. And as you can see, 37 shares. That, Vic, uh, that Phoenix Hawk, 19 shares, even though I destroyed a lot of the uh, components. But, yeah, I don't know. I'm gonna grab the victor. And then we're gonna grab the AC-20 and the AC-10, I guess. Alright. 10 million salvage. I will take that and be happy. Not bad. Not bad at all. Alright, let's see where we are right now. We need, we need new cantina missions. I still need to grab a supercharger somewhere. A supercharger Mark 1. Not Mark 2, this one has a Mark 2, I need a Mark 1. Okay. Okay. Where do we go next? There's another quest up here. Oh yeah, electronics. Is that a is that a quest? Travel to Jerupu. Okay, that's a level four quest line. Alright. It's the Crimson Crusade right here, bow and arrow, hazing of the week, and then bring her home. Level 10. That could be that could be hardcore. Let's see. I need to track this mission. I need to track this mission. Let's see where we have to go here. Uh star map. Okay. Uh here in this area, okay. Oof. Level 10 defense. I still need a bigger stompier robot. I feel like I need a bigger stompier robot. So let's see, Marek against Independence, uh, Steiner Demolition against Marek, Steiner Raid, Demolition against Curitans, Beachhead Steiner vs Draconis combine, and Defense Steiner vs Independence. Let's do that. That was independent sounds good. Oh, more transmissions. A Living Rebellion Part 2. Except, where do we have to go for this? Oh, right here. 
Aristotle, assassination contract. Ah, well, okay, that's gonna be the next one then. But first we are here and we're defending. So we go for max salvage shares, of course, as always, and then we will take a little bit more cash. All right. Because of the heavy weather, your visibility will be compromised on this mission, Commander. Stay frosty. I also could sell that Victor. Should we try that Rifleman? This is, hard, this is hard mode though, because we're dropping in a, a very underton mech. I'm gonna try the Rifleman. Let's see what happens. He might die here. So before we do that, let me just make a safe game. Just in case something really bad happens. Let's go. Yeah, seeing the contracts on the map is uh, with a mod. Lock and load, Commander. 91 rounds, Gauss. The have just tripped the outer perimeter alarm and are en route to your position. We anticipate that their objective is to raise this facility to the ground. Do not let that Gauss, happen. Gauss, baby. Gauss, Moving Gauss, on baby. At the moment, but don't get comfortable. Hostiles have been reported in the area. I, need to, I really need to use my AI mates now. Also, enhanced zoom would be nice. Oh. Okay. Target acquired. What was that? That looked weird. Requested location. I can't see shit. Repositioning complete. Forming on the commander. Did that hit? That hit actually. You can't you can't really see the projector of the Gauss though. Do you see how quick that dude was gone? I mean, the visibility is not helping right now. First fire goes. I remember why Gauss was so nice. Insane projectile speed. Not Gaussilla, but it will do, yep. Typical CB's evil grin bot activated. <laughs> Glad you caught it. Hmm. Uh, I kinda wanna remove that grin from my face now, but I can't. Now, if only we had something like a Fafni in the game, right? Looks like you've got their attention. I'm showing multiple <laughs> hostiles incoming on your position. Brianna, multiple hostiles incoming is useless if you don't give me a location. We talked about this. It's gonna, that's like me saying I'm gonna put it in, but not telling you where I'm gonna put it in. It's important to know the location. Jesus! Ow. I can't I can't see him, I can just I can just shoot the box. Uh, now I can see him at least a little bit. Bye bye. He's dead. Scorpion, light tank. Immortrix, welcome in. Stock, welcome in. Targets. Hello. Lerm 40 carrier. Okay. Etigados is happy that I found the hero rifle man. Yep. I like the Gauss rifles. It just, it just would need a, a light engine or an XL engine and medium lasers on top, and then it would be super good. As it is right now, it's not, it's not bad. It's fun, but I need more firepower. I also gotta be very careful here to let my teammates lead. Relocating to requested. Otherwise, we won't be living very long. 
Is that guy in range now? Nope. Hostiles have taken out the warehouse. Now he is. Our HQ has been decimated. Yep. Moving into formation. I have no idea which tier that Gauss is. I love the speed of the Gauss rifle rounds. Meow. It's almost like a real cannon. Artisan heavy tank. Invisible. No, that did not hit. That hit. We're fighting in the shade, boys! Well, fighting in the smoke, actually, but... Jenner. Jennery, Jennera. The general back fruiting. Come here. Bonk. Light packs against Gauss. Never a good idea. Of course, it's stack pulling. Hello. This is fun. So no spool up in the gauss like a McBoy online? Nope. This is the, the actual battle tech gauss where you don't have to spool it up. You just click a button and it goes pew. Reconnaissance flights show increased enemy presence in the vicinity. Be on the lookout for further hostiles. Oh, there we go. Enforcer. Oh, oh there's an enemy dropship coming in. Okay, everybody go here. That point received. Let's move. The Enforcer, Aaron Anderson. Oh, Target, Stalker. Stalker. And the Warhammer. Ow. That did not feel good. Damage to the facilities is minor at the moment, Commander. But we cannot allow such damage to cascade. Do what you can to draw the enemies away from here. Gonna have to hide a little bit. Is the side torso gone? Let's go for the enforcer next. That was a cockpit hit. That was not a cockpit hit. Nope. Oh, actually hit the cockpit. Oh no. It's exploding. The problem with that much PPC is you, you just can't shoot shit. You can't see shit. It's super hard to shoot the soccer in the cockpit. It's up here. Can you stop for a sec, please? No? Not fair. Here I was thinking we have a connection. Nope. Stalker is super hard to cockpit kill. There goes the side torso. And there goes the CT, I would say. Nope. Guys, can you please kill this guy? He's starting to annoy me. Okay. Jesus, those sensors. <laughs> Can't barely see anything. Ow. Rip. Coordinating on target ID. Thunderbolt, Lerm carriers, and a Jenner. Yep, and we're low. Unfortunately. And we're already bringing like a lot more ammo than we normally would have. Ow, dude. Why me? Any stack falling, once again. 
Do I have to the Thunderbolt? I hate his leg, I think. It's super hard to see. You guys are probably seeing nothing in the, on the stream right now. Come on, guys. Shoot! At the cockpit, out! Jesus. We can let them carry. Got him. Got him. Not the cockpit. Oh, I need to kill him before he kills me. Come on, guys! Jesus. He almost killed me. Useless. Oof. Rex, welcome in. Love your YouTube videos, you're welcome. Get to hear that. Oof, that thing almost got destroyed. As I said guys, this mech would be nice to have if you have it early in the, in the game. At this point where I'm at right now, too light. 1.4 million C bills, we get the Thunderbolt. That we actually city killed, okay. We got the PPC and the AC-10s. And then the AC-5s and... I don't know. A medium laser. Or is there some super supercharger Mark 2? No. Nah. And the Mark 1. Medium chem laser. Sure, why not? The funny thing is, I still outdamaged my AI mates by a factor of 3. Or 2. 2.2 two, two, 2 or something. That's those two of those rifles. Because the secret to doing damage in any game is to keep firing, boys. It's my it's my special secret that I keep sharing with you guys. <laughs> All right, let's see where we need to go next. Um, Aristotle, right? Let's head on over there and do that assassination contract.